Ron. Ron. Last name? Dunn. Is that your name, or are you telling me you're finished talking? Both. Done and done. <laughs> <laughs> I like Ron. Ron! Play with us! Okay. Ooh, Girls, Ron's got us. sharp tools oh, now. Ron. Ladies, eyes are watching, ears are listening, lips are closed, hands are still. See, they're very quiet. quiet. You, you should really try it. it. Listen well, listen well. That was well played. Children their age respond positively to melody and rhyme. They are great girls. You must feel very lucky to be their stepdad. I do, indeed. If you'll excuse me, Joe, I have to finish hogging out the cheeks on these lap joints. Oh, may maybe you could use this, uh, this jig I made. It's just a hardwood clamping block connected to a small piece of hackberry. You could use it to locate your cuts for the inside shoulder with without, without having, having to reset, reset the, the fence. fence. Exactly. <laughs> Muffin? Donna, this is crazy. Typhoon is an artist, and the human head is his is canvas. It... Just listen. You're going to cut the man's hair. You're going to charge him $8. It'll take you four minutes. So just shut up and make the man look like this. Fine. Ugh. So, Typhoon, what do you like to do for fun? I'm writing an electronic opera about Brittany Murphy, and I do the chandelier design for my friend's drag puppet show. No further questions. All I really want to do is dance. Except lately, all the good warehouse raves are filled with Euro trash. Euro trash? <laughs> I like that. It is indeed a garbage continent. Yes. Oh, my god, I had the worst time in Berlin last May. Everyone was on their stupid bikes. I was like, ew. <laughs> Please talk more about how you hate Europe and bicycles. This came out. Yeah. I am starving. I haven't had lunch since yesterday, so I'm gonna head over to Callahan's. Oh, no, 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 don't go there. They totally skimp on pickles. Let me go to Big Head Joe's for you. They have the most insane burritos. I don't much go for ethnic food. No, 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 trust me. They have one that's called the Meat Tornado. Literally killed a guy last year. You had me at Meat Tornado. Pierre Garçon was a sixth round pick. Kali was the fourth round. Indianapolis Colts know how to draft so well. They really do. <clears throat> Andy, this was delicious. It's awesome, huh? It's a whole new meat delivery system. Thank you, son. What do you say we go out to the parking lot and run a few pass plays to burn off the calories? You are an unstoppable good idea machine! <laughs> I like Andy. I'm surrounded by a lot of women in this department. And that includes the men. Hup! 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 Peyton Manning reading the defense! Reggie Wayne! Hold corner! <laughs> Andy, wait up! Oh, you feeling it? <laughs> wow, you suck at this. Donna, please back up two paces so I can physically destroy this machine. Can you chill a little, man? It's not real hunting. It's just a game. That you happen to suck at. You know what? That's a good point. What, that you suck at this? That it's not real hunting. Come with me. Hunting. No quarters required. Hang on. Do you have a license to hunt at night? Because you need a license. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were serious. Come on, now. You know I don't give a Fresh air, real weapons, an honest kill. There is no substitute for the real thing. You want to go back and play that video game, don't you? Yes. Damn it. OK, everybody, the Harvest Festival is tomorrow. And I am so proud of all of you. You've worked so hard. You're amazing. So I have a surprise. And it is possibly 
the best thing to potentially ever happen to anyone, anywhere in the history of the universe. Ladies and gentlemen, the world famous Lil Sebastian. What? Yes! No. Oh my god! Hey. Hey. Sebastian! Oh my god! <laughs> I never thought I'd get to meet him! <laughs> well done, Leslie, well done! <laughs> I have some very important news about our favorite mini horse, Lil Sebastian. Yay. Lil Sebastian! Yay. He died last night. No! But we can take comfort in the fact that he's in heaven now, doing the two things he loves doing the most, eating carrots and urinating freely. When I walked in this morning and saw the flag was at half-mast, I thought, all right. Another bureaucrat ate it. But then I found out it was little Sebastian. Half-mast is too high. Show some damned respect. I have cried twice in my life. Once when I was seven and I was hit by a school bus. And then again when I heard that little Sebastian had passed. His memory will live on as today we light a fire that will burn on for eternity. Oh my God, hey! Okay, deep breath. I think we got through it. Thank God. Yeah. Hey, Jerry, you put propane in the eternal flame, right? No, they were out. So I just got a big thing of lighter fluid. It's kind of the same thing. <gasps> oh! 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 We planned that! Wow! Wow! Oh! Right. Hey! This is the best meditation center in the area. It doesn't look like much. Oh, actually, this strip mall has surprisingly decent chi, although the smells from the Greek restaurant next door are not ideal. But through this door lies a deep, serene quietude. Yorgo, separakalo, skazbos! Excuse me, ladies, on your right. Now, take in the vibe of the room and remain open of mind and of spirit. Now quietly, sit behind me, and let's join breath. I'll stand. Interesting technique. All told, we were in there about six hours. And no, I was not meditating. I just stood there quietly breathing. There were no thoughts in my head whatsoever. My mind was blank. I don't know what the hell these other crackpots are doing. Ron, you radiated mindfulness. What were you thinking about? I wasn't thinking at all. Incredible. It takes a ton of work for me to get to that kind of a clear headspace, no matter how hard I try. Don't try so hard. Don't try so hard. Ron, I'm going to try your not trying method right here, right now. Chris, wait. I know this crap is important to you, so I should come clean. I got nothing out of that experience at all. So if you're looking for someone who enjoys meditation... Oh, I didn't expect you to enjoy it. My one reservation about you as a coworker was that you seem inflexible. And merely by agreeing to an activity you're not interested in, you showed flexibility. Ron, you've got the job. You want to head back? I do. But first... There's a hot spinning cone of meat in that Greek restaurant next door. I don't know what it is, but I'd like to eat the whole thing. And you're kind and you're thoughtful and you're always such a delight to have around. I'm sure you are going to be an incredible mother. Thanks, Larry, that's nice. Goodbye, Ann. I have enjoyed parts of our time together. Oh, oh God, Ron. <laughs> <laughs> that was really something. <laughs> Here. I didn't know what to bring you, so I just got some magazines and lipstick. Woman stuff. Thanks. All my parents got me was that. Okay, well, I'm not very good at visiting people in hospitals, so I'm going to go. Hey, if you see Andy, will you not tell him I'm here? Okay. Because of what happened, I don't want him to think... Stop! Don't want to know. The less I know about other people's affairs, the happier I am. I'm not interested in caring about people. I once worked with a guy for three years and never learned his name. Best friend I ever had. We still never talk sometimes. 